Tremendous eye appeal is what you notice first. Horizons Math is a workbook-based elementary and middle school math program that is colorful, fast-paced, and based on traditional spiral instruction. Concepts are introduced incrementally, then practiced, developed, and continually reviewed as other concepts are introduced. Carefully balanced, there is an excellent mix of multi-sensory, manipulative-based instruction and independent student work. Use of the teacher guide is recommended, but overall teacher involvement is at a medium level. The newest version of the K-3 program does not include any biblical content. However, there is still Christian content in grades four through six and in the pre-algebra and algebra courses. Course components include a teacher guide and a two-volume set of workbooks. The teacher guide is the heart of the program, containing easy-to-use daily lesson plans. Besides these plans, the teacher guide contains an overview, materials list, activities, and the supplemental worksheets. The one-on-one -on -one lessons, activities, and general language are designed for homeschoolers. Reduced student pages in the back provide answers to the work text exercises. There are 160 lessons per level, each requiring approximately 20 to 30 minutes per day. The instruction relies on only a few separately purchased manipulatives because common household items and homemade flashcards as well as charts and number lines found in the teacher guide are also used. A useful table in the teacher guide shows a list of needed manipulatives that includes what lessons they are used in. While the user-friendly teacher guides provide the parent appeal of this program, the workbooks are all about student appeal. They are enticing, bright, and colorful, providing instructional illustrations and practice for the lessons. They also review concepts that have been previously taught. There are two workbooks per grade level. With only brief instructions on each page of the workbooks, these are not intended to be self-instructional. The left-hand page of the teacher guide lesson provides the lesson concept and objectives, as well as teaching tips. Materials needed for the lesson are also listed here, although a complete chart of manipulatives for all lessons is at the beginning of the book. The right-hand page provides specific teaching activities. It's important to note that these teaching activities involve teacher and student interaction first, then independent student work. Each activity is introduced by the teacher and initial problems are used as explained examples. Flashcard drill often precedes these teaching segments. Activities start by having the student count out loud by nines to 108 while using the number chart. Flashcard drill is next, addition facts, subtraction facts, then number words. For the first written activity, the teacher and student read through and spell the word numbers prior to the student completing the matching on their own. Next comes the preparation for the student activity two, again with flashcards and written problems. Good mathematical form is encouraged with comments like, Insist the students say the answer to the addition fact. For example, 6 plus 8 equals 14, or 3 plus 7 does not equal 11. After this preparation, the student completes that activity independently. Then, it's noted in the teacher guide that the student should be able to complete the next two student activities, numbers 3 and 4, by themselves. To prepare for the time-telling exercise, small clock models are used with the students setting them with quarter-hour times and matching times set by you, the teacher. Then they finish the activity on their own. The last activity is review, and the student completes this on their own as well. Addition drills on an extra reproducible worksheet from the back of the teacher guide are referenced. Answers for these worksheets are provided. Grading student pages is done with the help of reduced copies of those same pages found in the back of the teacher guide. The box set contains the teacher guide plus the two student workbooks. The reproducible supplemental worksheets from the teacher guide are available as a separate purchase. These additional student worksheet packets contain one photocopy of each of those reproducible masters. We've had numerous requests for Horizons manipulative kits over the years, and we listened. In each grade level kit, we've included the items most used at that level. They don't include common household items like construction paper and a measuring cup, though. The Horizons program heavily utilizes flashcards for drill, and while many of these flashcards are included, the kits also provide some blank index cards so you can create some of the more specialized flashcards yourself. All the manipulatives are also available separately. 
There is a manipulative kit for each grade, but if you plan on using Horizons for grade K through three, we also offer a bundled kit, which includes all the items from the individual kits. Add-on kits make it easy to upgrade from one level to another if you already have a grade level kit. In other words, if you have the kindergarten or the K kit and want to continue in the first grade, you would simply purchase the K to one add-on kit to receive all those additional manipulatives. For many years, Horizons was just a K through sixth grade program, but now fans of the Horizons format have two additional course options, pre-algebra and algebra. What sets these courses apart from others is a student workbook format. These student workbooks are colorful and consumable. There are 160 lessons designed to be done in 45 to 60 minutes each day. Each lesson consists of a major concept and practice of previous concepts. A teaching box at the beginning of each lesson presents the mathematical instruction written directly to the student, and the adjacent classwork section is to be done by the teacher and student together. The activities section that follows is for reinforcement of both the new concept and practice of older ones. Scattered throughout the book are interviews called A Math Minute With. These interviews are with regular people who use math in their careers or jobs. These real-life examples, electrician, plant manager, race car driver, etc., are intended to answer the question, why do I need math? Every 10 lessons, you'll find a page entitled, It's College Prep Time. This is a page of multiple choice questions that are similar to standardized tests. The teacher guide is an important part of these courses and includes lesson plans, readiness evaluation, and instructions for using the course. Reduced copies of the student pages provide answers and solutions for the student book, tests, exams, and worksheets. Tests are taken every 10 lessons and are found in the tests and resources book. There are 16 tests along with four exams, which are to be taken every 40 lessons. 80 worksheets for reinforcement and drill practice and resources needed for the lessons are also found in this book. Let's take a moment to look through Lesson 20 in the Pre-Algebra course. Like in the younger levels, the teacher guide provides concepts, learning objectives, and teaching tips along with a list of materials needed. Likewise, lessons are provided on two facing pages. Unlike the younger levels, however, reduced copies of the student workbook are provided right in the lesson. At this level, the instruction is written directly to the student, but it is expected that the teacher is working through the lessons with the student using the helpful information in the teaching tips. Definitions are talked through first, then specific exercises are designated as classwork. In this lesson, the student is using algebra tiles found in the tests and resources book to illustrate the concepts being taught. Following the classwork, the student is assigned the remaining activities on the front and back student worksheet. Following this lesson, the student is scheduled for the bi-weekly test. Students are not tested over the most recent material, though. For instance, the test after Lesson 20 covers material from Lesson 8 through Lesson 17. Following each test, the additional segments called It's College Prep Time and The Math Minute complete the interlude before returning to the daily lessons. The complete box set includes the teacher guide, the student workbook, and the tests and resources book. A set of additional student worksheets is available as a separate purchase. Horizons has many features that are appealing to homeschoolers, starting with its ease of use and the colorful, attractive student materials. If you have questions about the Horizons courses or other math options, please contact the Rainbow Consultants. You can reach us by phone at 888-841-3456 or by email at consultants at rainbowresource.com.